to my channel my name is yet today hi 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 it is monday morning and i'm having a walk in our estate because it's needed it's already um what time is it actually it's 11 30 and i just had breakfast literally i had breakfast and and i left the house and i'm just like flipping heck mate i'm already knackered um, what have I been doing today? How am I tired? I'm just tired. So I woke up and we, like, and the first thing I do is get Fermi ready for bed. Um, ready for bed? See, my, my mind is still waking up. But Fermi wakes up about like, what time does she wake up? Like 7, sometimes 6.30. And you know when you know that you've had a late night? I went to bed like 1.30 yesterday, 1.30 a.m. or well, this morning. And she woke up at seven no about six thirty Woo, doggy dog and i'm this dog is a bit too i'm it's, it's, it's behind the gate but i'm scared but anyway so i woke up about like she woke up about like six thirty going seven so when she wakes up you know i'm always the one that will hear her and it's always me like i don't understand like mums is it just me or do the dads never hear when the child wakes up <laughs> is just too small i can't even show you the dog the gate was just too small the dog wanted to just come outside and devour me give me a shift anyway um what was i saying oh that was so scary <laughs> so scary i don't know if i'll be doing walks i didn't want to walk again oh, i know i'll be walking around anyway um what am i saying now my mind is blank because i'm just too fearful after that dog Jesus Christ is Lord. <sighs> okay, so yeah, so she woke up. So, so I'm just, so the question is like, is it true that like, is it, is it just me? Or do dads never hear the child waking up? Never, like this morning I, I vexed, I was like, babe, babe, she's awake, please go and get her. Because I always have to go and get her. When I go and get her, I just start getting her ready in the morning. But um, when he goes to get her, he brings her to our bed, you know, unready. And I know she was, she's ready for the day. Like once she's awake like that, she, it's unlikely that she'll want to sleep again. And that was what happened. And I'm the one that has to deal with it. She's like, mommy, stand up. Mommy, get up. Mommy, breakfast time. She'll go on and on and on. She'll be like, mommy, watch. Like if, if, if all else feels like let her watch something on, on my phone, I'm like, no, no, you need to have breakfast. And I'm, I'm like, Fermi, please, just 10 more minutes, five more minutes, two more minutes of sleep. But yeah, anyway, that never really happened. So, I'll put on that, right? so yeah, that never happens. So I'm always like, oh, I'm tired. But as usual, I have to drag myself out of bed and just get over it and get on with it really and yeah so when i so once i get her ready she's gonna take her downstairs for breakfast and everything so i said oh, let me come upstairs and have a shower as one baby has been sorted out the other baby is requiring something and when i mean something i think you guys will understand what i mean i don't need to like go into it too much but i'm just like are you having a laugh like do you not have mercy on me? Or well, what is the deal with you guys? Like, can we just have a chill? Can we chill? Can I just like wake up and have breakfast first? Is that all right? But I me, mean, I was, my mind was so focused on something else. But my, Mr. Mr. Man, my lovely husband, took that opportunity to um, help himself, if you know what I mean. So yeah, I'm just like, am I the only one? Like early morning, early morning before breakfast. Steph. That's the one thing that one's husband wants to eat. Not that <laughs> eat, I mean, um, well, you know what I mean. 
that's what that's the, that's what that's their pre-breakfast anyway. I'm always like, you guys, we well, thank God. You know, my husband has a healthy appetite for me, and I and I do for him, so it's all good. But let me, but let's be honest, ladies. Is it just me? Is it not knackering to wake up early in the morning? You know you've you've not had a great night's sleep, and what's it called? You know you still got you got you've got a long day ahead of you. And children are demanding and all that stuff. And then children are demanding and then husband is also demanding. What do you flipping well do? Can you, I hope you can hear me. Because opening of gates is causing so much um, commotion and noise. But yeah. Oh, this life, we done good. So this is my day one. I'm going to do a day, um, five days of me having a walk. So consequently, I'm going to do five days of me doing something slightly out of the ordinary. Some things in the ordinary, but it will be slightly out of the ordinary because I'll be doing it every day. And I'll be uploading every day and just doing it with you guys every day, Monday to Friday, apart from Thursday, because, you know, that's when I, that's, that's a job. And y'all know what a job means. Not a job, a job. Or job or anyway join me on Thursdays and then if you don't know what I mean then join me on Thursdays so yeah this is Lagos streets I'm in the main streets of Lagos no it's not me no it's not me it's a decent estate and good <laughs> but um yeah it's not great though look at the you probably have seen the open gutters and the bumpy roads Lagos government we need to do better this is not it this is not inviting for I want tourists, this is not very inviting to see massive open gutters. It's really not. And besides, this is where this is where um, the mosquitoes are rife because of the open gutters. Thank God they're not full of anything. They're actually open, they're actually clear, but in general. Anyway, I'm going off topic now. I'm tired. I'm walking and talking to the energy and stuff. So I'm gonna say peace out. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Ooh. Leave your comments and let me know. What? Leave your comments below and say what's up, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.